so hey guys welcome back to my channel today i will be attempting a flexi rod set on my hair so please just bear with me as i struggle to get it right <laughs> also guys um don't mind me um you may see me talking in the video i was on the phone guys so to start the video um i just started to section my hair um because i wanted it to fall a certain way so you're just gonna see me sectioning my hair and twisting it up and then the back part i just put in a ponytail guys so what i do first is i pretty much um go in and section my hair in little sections and then i take the a lot of body mousse and i work that into my strands not so much to where it's like wet and it can you know revert back to its natural um texture but just to where like it gets it in just a tad bit okay now as you can see guys i started at the base and then i tried to like twist it in and then um you know take the little end piece sometimes you gotta add more mousse to like your end so it could really um mold well and then i folded it in um i tried this method i wasn't really a fan of it um, for my next ones, you're going to see it in a different method. Um, I really struggled with this one, guys. For this method, as you can see, um, I put the mousse on my hair and then I um, combed it out a little bit just to detangle it and then I grabbed the flexi rod and then now I'm going to roll it up from the bottom. Um, I want to make sure my ends are enclosed in. So I grab the bottom and I twist it and then I take my hair and roll it over the ends. As you can see in the video, I tried to record it good enough for you guys. Um, I hope it is beneficial. But then I just roll the hair upward. Um, and as you guys can see, I struggled a little bit. <laughs> but I feel like this was probably the best method for me personally. And I pretty much do this one throughout the whole head. It kind of-ish. <laughs> As you can see guys um i do another one um it's a little bit sped up but i feel like this is a better visual Okay, so I ran out of flexi rods 
unfortunately. So I had to um, do the method where you do two sections on one flexi rod. So with this one, um, you pretty much start the flexi rod in the middle and then you do kind of like how I showed you guys the first method. Um, you wrap the hair around from the base and then you want to make sure that your ends are like formed around the flexi rod and then you're going to um bend the flexi rod on your end so it doesn't get loose and then you're gonna have to grab your second piece and wrap that around the other end of the flexi rod this one was a little bit challenging so if you do not want to do this method please make sure that you have enough flexi rods for your whole head um as you can see i have multiple different colors in my head which is the reason why i feel like my flexi rod didn't come out how I really wanted it to. Okay, so this is the same method as the last. Um, I'm just using the orange flexi rod. Um, I feel like it shows it a tad bit better. Um, so hopefully you guys can get the concept of what I'm doing. I hope this wasn't a waste. So yeah, just enjoy the rest of the video. <laughs> Y'all know I had to check just to see if this whole process was worth it. You know what I'm saying? So this is what it looked like after I was done with my whole head. All right. So the next morning was the takedown process. Um, I pretty much just unraveled the flexi rods. Um, I just sped this up because I feel like this is self-explanatory. Um, the ones that kind of came a little undone, I twisted it up a little bit um i definitely noticed while i was taking them down that the ones that i used the purple ones for they were bigger looser curls um so if you have longer hair i feel like that would be the perfect size for you um i feel like for me my i should have stuck with the color scheme of the gray and the orange ones um i definitely felt like that was the curl pattern that i was looking for
these guys so i went in with the alley k naturals finishing oil and um i just began to separate the hair um as i separated them um i twisted them you know around my fingers just so that they can maintain their curl um i definitely noticed as i was taking them down that my orange and gray flexi rods they came out much better than the purple ones the purple ones looked super loose and they didn't really last too long so i definitely know for next time to stay with the gray and orange um besides that i just ended up separating them as best as i could and then i um fluffed them out a little bit with a wide tooth comb with a pick yeah with a pick and that was pretty much my takedown process for it and i believe towards the end i decided to style it in a pineapple guys so what i did was um i pretty much um grabbed my little hair typing that i use for my puffs um separated some bangs or like brought some bangs out and i decided to just do a pony not a ponytail like a high ponytail bun whatever with um bangs I felt like that was the best way that I wanted to wear it, especially with um, the looser curls towards the middle because of the purple flexi rods. So, but I was pretty satisfied with it. Um, I'm not gonna lie, for my first time, I was pretty shocked that it came out this well. Um, and then I just did my edges, and yeah, that was pretty much it. I was pretty satisfied. pretty much this was the final look thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed the video please like comment and subscribe and i'll see you guys next time